So this is the Spider-Man I've made out of paper and it's 11 inches so it rotates, it moves, it bends its arm, its head goes up and it turns, its head turns, then his body can do that and then his leg comes up, his leg, and then it bends like that, see it bends, his leg bends, and when his leg bends, he can do all sorts of things and then his leg can lift up high like this leg and lift that high until it stops there and then it comes back down then he can turn the waist like that and then his arms can also turn the other way and then his legs and then some foot features his foot his foot goes like this and then it turns like that that's another one his arm goes like this another feature his arm does that and then his face this and then goes this way and then goes this way and then he's also attached detachable also detachable so what you can do is with them you can actually take them loose like Legos. This comes off. This comes off. The head comes off because it's swappable. And the legs come off. And that's all that comes off. And I haven't made his hands yet because I haven't got a chance. So, this is his legs by themselves. All paper. This is his other leg. And this arm. And this is the joint that he rolls on. And that's the other joint. This is the T joint. And this is the double joint. And this is a T joint on his leg. And that's the T joint. And this is a double joint because the double goes up. Then it rolls the other way. And his head has two joints. It's a double joint. And the inside, that makes it goes like this and like that. So his head can go bob or like this and it's all paper so this is the actual figure I've been working on for a month now and I'm just not putting it on here and so I'm gonna put it back together that's his head together now I'm gonna put his legs on I mean his arms on it's like you slide it inside that hole take it slide it in So his arms are sliding in, and they're still bendable. And this is the chest pivot. And then I'm gonna stick his legs in. See up close. That's the leg hole. Stick him in. Stick him up. Okay, so stick him in. I'm gonna stick the other leg in. Now they'll be able to turn again. So it just rolls of paper. No, it's paper. Yep, and that's it. And it's also. And it's 11 inches. Now I'm going to show you some poses it could do. That's the post detail of his foot. That's the bottom of the boot. That's the spider detail. And the webbing was done with the silver pen. But the most detailed part was his face, and that was the first part that I ever made of this action figure. Now I'm going to show you the back. So I'm going to flip him over. And there, it's flipped over. And that's the back of the paper Spider-Man. But he's not finished yet, I'm just showing it to you a little bit. That's the back feature. As you can see here, his foot's again. You can see the webbing down on the patch. You can see the clothing details right up in there. 
Then you can see the pivot. And that's where it been. Yep. See the pivot. And that's the head. The bobble. The arm goes like that. Then it bends forward. And that's the little spider right there. Spider. Zoom in a little bit. That's the drawing spider. Well done. I was very proud of this action figure. So now I'm going to put in some poses. So Spider-Man can sit like that in his sitting position, but you see his legs can bend. That part bends. This little area right here bends. And his face bends, and his arms are curly back. He bends in that position. And I'll show you some more, and then we'll be done.